In this tutorial, we're going to take a look at how you go about actually making an edit and update on a web page within uh, ModX. When you log into the ModX Manager, here on the left, you'll see all the different pages on your website. Uh, in this particular example, let's edit the How It Works page. And I'm going to come over here and I'll navigate, which I already have, to the How It Works page. Well, this is very, very simple to make the edits and updates. You can edit, for example, the title. I would just simply enter my text and change it. I can come down, for example, let's look down here in this section. You'll notice that we have some padding or spacing on the uh, left of each one of these titles, and I don't like that. Well, how do I remove it? Just like using a Word document, you come over here and you put your mouse in, you make edits. You'll notice you have these toolbars up here where you can highlight text and make changes. You can indent, create lists, bold, strike through. You got a lot of different functions up here. So let's say in this example, we have get started and snap with an exclamation. And really, I want three exclamation points to emphasize this title. Well, once I make this edit or update, and by the way, these edits can be down here in this area as well, changing an image, text. There's so many things I could change on here. But whenever I've made the changes that I like, simply come over here to save. When I uh, save it, it's going to reload. You'll see, you saw that it just uh, kind of did a refresh. You see it, it did that right there on the left. I'm going to come over here and I'm going to hit the refresh button on my browser. And sure enough, there's three exclamation points and this text moved over a little. It got, rid, uh, got rid of that padding. Now, obviously, I'll take that out. I'm sure, they don't want three exclamation points, but went ahead and saved it. So all you have to do in ModX is just come over to the page you want, you click on it, you make your changes, and hit save. It's as easy as that.